What is up you guys? You're watching Stranger Secret and as you can see my background is quite different. I'm currently in Mexico as I'm filming this video. I'm going to be here for a couple of days, like a little bit over a week. So hopefully you guys like this little new backdrop. I really like the natural lighting. I like the way the background looks. So I hope you guys love it, give you a little bit of culture. And today is going to be my favorite accessories. And this is going to be a partnership with Farfetch. So one of the main reasons why I really like shopping at Farfetch is for me, it's going to be the shipping. It's incredibly fast. Like it is absolutely crazy the way they ship items. Like things came from New York. Things, one of them came from Singapore. One of the items came from Europe. The fact that the shipping is incredibly fast and the fact that like US retailers take much more of a longer time to you know even get some of these items here in mainland US is quite shocking so for me I always love Farfetch because you get the items literally so fast so if you need to go on a trip if you need to you need the item by a certain date I just like that it's you know the fact that it's shipping overseas and the fact that it's coming a million times more faster than you know a warehouse here in the US like when I worked at Nordstrom oh my god things would take up to almost 10 days to get and the fact that I got these literally in half of that some of them I got them like in two days I placed order on a Monday and by Thursday half of the orders were already here it says quite a lot so I do like shopping on Farfetch because the things just come really really fast and also all the things come packaged very very nicely versus some other places the, the items just literally thrown and it's like you know here you go it is what it is and you don't get that nice presentational packaging you don't get you know nice tissue paper you don't get thank you for your purchase it's literally here's the item and they keep it moving so i do like through most retailers of farfetch well all of them that i purchased from they all have the nice packaging and some of them even come with the shopping bags or little stickers and stuff so i do appreciate that I like farfetch because you could also you can buy everything you can buy prada gucci you can buy very very designer well-known designer brands but you also buy like brands like sex pots you can buy jack moose brands that are designer that are popular but they may not be mega mega designer and then you can also buy your contemporary like your Troy Birches your Marc Jacobs which are brands that I definitely love so for me that's why I really like shopping at Farfetch and they just cater to so much audiences and they just have so much merchandise but also their merchandise isn't all over the place um, they have quite a good edit on the things that they carry so for me I just really really like shopping at Farfetch and without further ado I want to say that I do have a coupon code my coupon code is Sergio YT10 which I'll insert right here and go ahead and leave all the information down below this coupon code will expire November uh, 14th 2021 so you will see me mention this code throughout um, throughout this code being expired especially on Instagram so if I do purchase something else make sure to follow me on Instagram because you can get a discount code through Farfetch but like I said I'll leave the coupon code right here and I'll leave all the terms and conditions down below but without further ado let me show you my favorite trends that are accessories for fall um, for this year and the first one is gonna come from either Prada or Nada so here it is Prada this actually shipped from the Prada store in Fifth Avenue which is quite exciting the fact that I even got the beautiful Prada you know shopping bag the whole experience it came in the beautiful box and it came even the receipt right here said Prada in it and it is just it is literally perfect like I just love the packaging I love that I have the presentation I love that I have the shopping bag I like that it came with the box and the entire packaging was very very nice that's something that I re really did like and obviously guys if you know me about the Prada glasses you guys have been seeing me rock these in black so obviously I decided to get them in white so here is the beautiful case I like that they come in this little pouchy uh, kind of like this silky blue color i like that it has little drawstrings it looks very very nice and this is very compact for smaller handbags but the glasses that i got guys and this is a trend that will be going forward i feel like kind of versace started this trend when they kind of brought back kind of like those biggie glasses which are these ones right here but i feel like the prada ones are just kind of like a more of a updated kind of like 2021 2022 version and they are the prada um runway sunglasses and these are in the beautiful white but what i like about the white is that the black lens is actually pretty dark you cannot see my eyes throughout them i like that they have the silver hardware and i just like the dimensions of these glasses i think it looks quite phenomenally well um i'm gonna point them right here 
love the details of the glass and if you guys know me i have so many sunglasses me even working at nordstrom i would get glasses gifted i would buy glasses full price because i genuinely like them and honestly these are the glasses of the year like these are sergio's secret glasses but these are glasses that everyone has been wearing these kind of like smaller kind of wrap glasses that has a little bit of a thick acetate um before that had the white ones i also have the black ones which i'll enter here and you can also get them on farfetch I just think that they suit my face really well. I used to have kind of like smaller rough glasses. These ones fit my face really well. I have a big head. I think it looks super cool, super sleek. You can dress it up. You can dress it down. Um, I think wrap glasses are really a really great trend. But I think for me, what makes them more wearable is the chunky sides. If the sides were a little bit thinner, I find that they won't be as wearable. But what I like is that whenever you wear them, you're living your best life. The sun doesn't really hit the side of your eye. So I like that they're well protected. 100% UV protection. They're beautiful, they're nice, and they go really well. And these will even transition really well into the spring and summer because it is a crisp white color. But this with the beautiful white blazer, with the beautiful coat, um, this will these glasses will take you, you know, and everywhere. And for me, these product glasses I've been loving. Like I have not fell in love with the glass since um, since I started working at Nordstrom many years ago. And I actually want them um, in the brown color as well. So the first trend that I've been seeing a lot of people wear. And accessories are a lot of me are kind of like these kind of wrap around glasses and it's for a good reason because they're nice they fit proportional but they also cover you on the side and sometimes when the arms are a little bit thin and you're driving down the freeway or you're just walking sometimes you don't want the eye you know the the thinner arms to kind of hit your eye so i like that i'm well protected and hey they're nice slick and they're prada and these ones would go really well with a lot of the ecosystems that i have in prada i have a prada loafer i have a prada handbag and these ones just kind of playing with it so so I will say Prada runway glasses are definitely for the win. Next trend that I see very popular are going to be practical mini bags. So you guys know I love me like mini bags, like baby jock moose bags, like baby like bags that can only fit a card. But you know that's not practical for everybody, and I definitely understand that. And so I want to show you a practical mini bag that is mini because they have it in a larger version, but is actually like you can fit quite a lot in it. And so the one that I picked out is going to be this Tory Burch T Monogram Peri Tote and the smaller size and so the reason why i picked this up is because i already have the larger peri toe and the blue monogram and so i love it so much and i use it so much and i was like you know what i think that when i saw this color i was like oh my god this is the perfect fall bag like you cannot tell me this colorway is not perfect for fall beautiful brown leather throughout it with this beautiful kind of white stitching and what i like that it's practical is like not only is it a cute top handle toe i just love the practicality of more smaller bags and i do consider this more of a mini bag i wouldn't consider it a micro bag so what i like is that first of all it has these straps so you have a strap right here it is adjustable you can make it into a crossbody you can make it into a shoulder bag and you can also carry it in the crook of your arm but not only that like i said you can adjust the strap but then on the inside you can you have compartments on in here so you have a little pocket right here which you can put your cell phone you can put maybe your glasses if you forgot your case you can fit that puppy right in there and it fits there absolutely perfectly it has this beautiful uh, kind of like suede like lining it believe it's microfiber and then you have a nice pocket in here so you can put maybe a little bit more of your secure items and you just open that baby up and it fits everything right there perfectly but for me i will say you know i think we are kind of getting away with like mini bags and i think we're replacing them with more practical mini bags this is something that you could use so much that you could dress up that you can dress down um they have these peri totes in full leathers um they have them these this monogram and the navy one so if you particularly don't like the brown one there's other peri tote versions but for me um i like this one and it also have, has has feet at the bottom i really like this one just because it's brown it's going to go well with a lot of camel coats with a lot of my chelsea boots with white sneakers i knew that this colorway was going to be perfect and this is the literally the perfect brown so i think it's absolutely perfect and i'm here for it so you're going to see me rock this bag for the rest of the fall and for the winter season just because it the perfect shade of brown and it is a practical mini bag i could essentially fit everything that i need inside of here and i i love it and you guys know i'm a big tori tori fan so when i saw this one i said oh yes t monogram yes 
parry tool version, yes. Um, it can fit still everything, yes. So that's why I definitely went for the parry tool. But I think the practical mini bags um, is going to be a little bit more of the trend. And that's why I've been seeing even more people kind of carry like the bigger Jock Moose bags or a little bit bigger bags that were maybe more popular in the smaller sizes because uh, we want a little bit more practicality. Yes, we love a super like ridiculously small bag. I think being more practical is always going to work out in the long run um, than things that are a little bit more novelty. So um, parry tool perfect i love it so much trend is going to be a bad hair day this item so before i came back so i'm you know i live in dallas i was in houston and then i'm here in mexico i got a notification that i left my hat in the hotel room so unfortunately i do not have this item and when i go back to houston i will pick it up because after here i am going to go back to houston for a couple more days but um for me the item that i picked up is going to be and it's going to be this tomi hat um i have a picture of it here i've been kind of wearing it because i wanted to style it for you guys unfortunately i I don't have it here with me which is really really sad i feel kind of bad that i left in my hotel room, but i'm also grateful that they called me and they told me that it is there so when i go back to houston i will pick it up but it is just your classic black hat ever since i kind of shaved my head off or even kind of when i st when i still had my purple hair whenever my roots were shown i just found it very practical just to put on a hat and just kind of call it a day i think a hat instantly dresses up an outfit or whenever you do have a bad hair day maybe your front your roots are done put a hat and you're good to go and this told me one is absolutely perfect it goes with everything it's a little bit more of a premium style hat but when you dress it up when you dress it down it looks phenomenally well and it's really great quality it actually came with a beautiful dust bag in it so it is a good quality hat and i think for me i think we don't need to normalize bad hair days we need to normalize you know you know it's okay if your hair is not all the way done girl put a little cap on and call it a day so i will say one of the biggest trends that i've been seeing is just the more kind of like casualness of you know items you know we saw that kind of when we started going on lockdown but i see we're starting to kind of go with that but i'll be a little bit more elevated showing your roots out i think it's kind of good just to kind of put a hat and you just call it a day but i will say hats are always been a little bit more popular here in the fall season well here in texas hats are always popular people always wear hats but i will say hat has been something that i've been incorporating a lot of you guys have been seeing me throughout hauls you've been seeing me throughout like shopping vlogs i have been purchasing quite a bit of hats i went from having like one hat to now i believe i have like 12 hats but this told me one i've been using um i've been loving ever since i purchased it so i think it is a really great one unfortunately like i said i left it in my hotel room in houston but i think it's a really great one and it's a, my first item from this brand and i'm very very excited to try more items from this brand but i think it is worth it a black classic hat that's elevated that's good quality you can never go wrong with so i am definitely going to recommend it and i think that is a really great trend is just you know the hair accessories especially kind of like i said you know it's okay to have a bad hair day it's okay you know for me i want people to get a haircut because i'm loyal to my barber so you know i, I want people to get a haircut like well over a week from even me recording this video so i'm gonna be like two and a half weeks without a haircut so best to believe i'm gonna be wearing hats all the way just because you know what sometimes you know if my hair feels like a hot mess even though i do have short hair put on a cap and period call it a day the next trend is going to be a trend that has been popular but i find that within this last season has been a little bit more popular and it's going to be functional nylon so i feel like nylon has always been a material that people have always loved and used but we've been seeing this with prada we've been seeing this with longshop and even other brands that don't particularly push nylon as much as some of their other lines i've been seeing nylon be a little bit more on the practicality side it's always been practical but even more practical so the item that i picked out is going to be this longshop um handbag and for me i love 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 this when i worked at Nordstrom, i always wanted to purchase one i just never found the colorway that i wanted i just didn't want to get it with the brown leather i wanted to have it with either black trimming or just something but just not with the brown and so when i saw this on farfetch i was like this is the perfect combination i've been literally waiting for you because i did purchase two long shumps when i was working there i had the black with the crossbody strap and then a baby one that i would use as a lunchbox but i would always want a humongous one and this is perfect because i was i was using this when i was going to houston i'll enter a picture of it here um as you can see i bought a lot of things i do have another haul to do but as you can see i have so much stuff inside of it and also the way it sat on my remova luggage was absolutely perfect literally i had all my stuff here i had laptops i had bags i had my beauty bag i had all my more pricey accessories i had it all 
hole here. I literally put the handle through the Romova luggage and literally it would, it would not fall off. It would not move because uh, at my hotel room, the walking to the garage to my car was a little bit of a walk and nothing absolutely happened. It was absolutely perfect. And for me, I just love the functionality of nylon. Uh, you know, even though this does have a little bit of cream lining throughout it, version where it has one full solid color and then it has a little bit of another corresponding color i just like the white kind of creamy color i think it goes really well like i said we would carry these club versions and like different like like different corresponding colors but for me i always kind of wanted like more of a neutral one and i like the snap closure is this beautiful cream color and obviously with long shop you can literally fold this baby up and you can bring this with you so if you are going to go on a trip and let's say you are going to bring up a lot of stuff back you can literally fold this baby up and you can make it very very functional how functional this is like literally you can put it in like this so it went from being a big spacious you know handbag or like a travel bag and now it's super tight it's super compact you can after you're done with your trip you can put this in your car like even when you go grocery shopping or you go to aldi or you know wherever you need to go to or you're going to the flea market these ones are really great especially the huge larger ones just because this literally fits in your car this can literally this can literally even fit in this little peri tote that i have here from toy where just i'm saying mini bags that are practical you could easily fit this in here and you can still put your cell phone, you can still put your wallet, you can still put quite a bit of stuff in it and you have the zipper, but you can still carry this little long shop nylon. So I think that these little long shop nylon bags, especially this one that's humongous, I think they're really practical because they're nice, they're compact, they're durable but it will take you for everywhere. So um, I definitely love this one and I definitely do see myself using these on a lot more trips just because it's literally the most compact item and I'm moving uh, very, very soon. So this one will be a nice, I would use, I'm would. i gonna be using this as my handbag so I can put all my stuff here back and forth, back and forth, back and forth. But yes, um, functional nylon, I would say is a big trend um, this season. I just think it's nice and it's easy and we love things that are just very, very carefree. So um, this long shop nylon bag, I love it and look look how big this turns up like it is absolutely humongous and the nylon on on long shop is unbeatable and when you think of long shop i think of their beautiful nylon so um functional nylon is definitely going to be um for the win last trend are going to be functional tote bags so Tada! This bag I've been wanting. I styled it in like a little video, which I'll insert here. I wore a white blazer. I wore these patch denim jeans, and then I also wore some white booties. And I wore this one. It was literally the perfect combination outfit. And then also with these white Prada glasses. Chef trend I'm gonna be saying is gonna be the functional tote bags. I love me a good functional tote bag, but that still has like a lot of fun. I was in Miami and I saw one of my friends have this bag and I said, at first I was like, mm, cause I just purchased another dub, the Marc Jacobs tote bag. But once I saw her rock it, I was like, I absolutely, absolutely, absolutely have to have this. So I got it via Farfetch. It was already sold out on a lot of department store websites here in the US. And I said, I have to have it. So the reason why I'm making this a functional tote bag is just because you want into the trends of items, but we also want them to make them functional. Yes, even me, like, you know, I'm single, like, you know, I have a very carefree lifestyle. Sometimes I, I am busy and I do things, I do love things that are very carefree and that are very, you know, that are pretty, but are yet yeah, very, very functional. This denim bag, I definitely love the tote bag Marc Jacobs. It has this beautiful stitching in the back, but what I love is that it has a full zipper, so your items will be 100% protected nobody missed thing nobody's gonna be stealing nobody's gonna be grabbing your stuff and then it also has this beautiful thick strap right here that's made out of fabric and you can make it into a crossbody or a shoulder bag but no matter like what your width is within your body you can definitely make it super long you can make it super short you can really make it um what you want it to be with this tote bag so i will say practical tote bags are the win and it's going to be the move especially ones that have longer straps i think that's going to be the move for tote bags going in the future for mark jacobs is going to be my pick on it and i love it so much but they have so many variations on farfetch of the tote bag by mark jacobs they have like a lot of versions that aren't even out here in the states yet or that won't even be available in the states so i would definitely check their selection on the tote bags it is still one of my favorite collections from mark jacobs and it's still one of my favorite collections in general so if you are interested in the tote bag i would definitely check it out on farfetch but i love this one and this one goes with all the blue denim fantasy i'm wearing blue jeans right now this will go with 
with it because it has different shades of blue if it was one shade of blue i feel like i wouldn't have purchased it but since it has different ones it goes with all the shades of blue so even if i'm not wearing the exact same shade of blue here it kind of color blocks it and it kind of gives it um it kind of makes it pop out a little bit more and that's what i love 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 about this one and i love the little brown details and i love the little patch because it looks like you know those denim patches behind your jeans that say like levi's or whatever on it it kind of reminds me of that this one just says the mark jacobs on it but yeah guys these are going to be my some of my favorite trends for accessories that are practical for the fall and winter time or even not even fall and winter these are items that these are trends that you could always kind of use going into the next year as well i love all the items here on this video i think that they're all well i think they're well curated and i think that they're really really great items but yes guys i would definitely definitely check out farfetch they definitely have everything thank you so much farfetch for um doing this video with me and remember i do have a 10 percent off code so if you do want to check it out i'll leave it right here and i'll leave all the information down below let me know what is your favorite item that i picked up the long shop the tory birch um t monogram peri toe the mar jacobs tote or the prada runway sunglasses or the tote me hat i would definitely love to hear your opinions down below and i would definitely love to see what you guys purchase from farfetch and you guys could always always um tag me on instagram and i'll be happy to repost it on my stories thank you thank you so much for watching guys all the links for everything will be down below and i'll see you guys on the next video thank you thank you so much for watching and you'll see more videos here living the gay fantasy in mexico bye guys and thank you thank you so much for watching this video